And here we have uh, create new. So if I click on this, it's going to ask me, do you want to save this? I will say no for now. And as you saw, we added these layers from different sources, but we are going to save this all as MXT document file. So MXT is uh, like a project file that contains all the things we have done here. All the things we change it right now, like this current extent and this layers and how it looks like, going to be saved as MXE. So I come here, click File, and I click Save. And it's going to ask me where you want to save it. And I'm going to go to my course, click Map, and I'm going to save it here untitled. I'll call it MXD1, MXD1, and save it. Now I have my XD, I can close ArcMap and open the same MXD later again or share it with someone. But in order to share the MXD file, I need to share also all the data that we added separately here. And they need to, uh, whoever going to take the MXD to make sure that they have the right source. So how can I know where this uh, layer is located? I right click on it and I click properties and I go to source. I see where this layer is saved. And if so, if I wanted to share my MXD with, any, with anyone, I need to send the MXD and send this geodatabase and also send all the source of this other layers, except the base map, because base map already comes with our JS map. The next thing here is to open existing MXD. So if I click here and I want to open an existing MXD, like this one, I'm going to double click on it. He asked, they asked me, do you want to save this one? I say yes. So after I saved my MXD, I can work on another MXD or select a new one and choose a blank one. And my previous MXD have been saved, so I can easily select open and open my MXD file again and go back to where I was from G at the end of this video, I want to thank you so much for having the time to watch the video. If you are interested to learn more about ArcGIS products, please go to arcgismastery.com and you will see that we have a lot of selection for online training courses, starting by ArcGIS Desktop and another products like ArcGIS Online, ArcGIS Pro, ArcGIS Enterprise, and so many more. We also have coming courses that you can subscribe to and enroll right now and get a 50% discount. And we will appreciate it if you leave a comment below and let us know what exactly you need to see in this course so we include it in the course for you. And lastly, I will encourage you so much to subscribe to our monthly updates so you can stay updated with what Esri do. At the end, I wish you all the best and thank you so much for watching this video.